Alright guys, it's JP Positive and I am finally back. I was not able to make it to the pre-release last Saturday, but I am going to be going to that forbidden pre-release today and I will be giving away codes in my next video that I will be posting up tonight. So make sure that you guys do check that out. But right now, quick news and information update for anybody that has not seen already. They are already announcing our August set for America, Europe, and a few other countries, Sun and Moon, Celestia Storm, not 100% sure if that's how you accurately pronounce it, but that's how I'm going to say it guys, it is going to be a pretty fun set, looks like 130 cards, we are going to be seeing a Rayquaza GX, Blaziken GX, and a few more GXs as well, 11 GX total, 3 Ultra Beasts, Prism Star, 27 trainer cards, and a Rainbow Energy as well. So, pretty cool in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you haven't already, do give this video a like for those forbidden like codes that I will be giving out later, as well as the pre-release. Hopefully, I will get some pictures in, and I will be posting them on my Facebook page, and you guys can go ahead and check them out. So, with all that said, we're going to move on to the Champions Road. They actually have the complete set. Now the Champions Road is a, a just revealed all the cards from Champions Road. Let's see, the set will release in Japan on May 3rd. The cards from the set will be included in the Celestella Storm set in August. Okay, so all these cards, we're not going to be getting to August, but we do have the complete set already with the translation. So, that's pretty good. Let's go ahead and check them out. We have a bell sprout. Not going to go through all of them like always, guys. I'll go ahead and zoom in on the pictures just so everybody can kind of get the idea. Don't want the video to be too long because I am going to have a longer video tonight for Forbidden Light. Ooh, nice Scyther right there. Let's go ahead and check him out. Twin play, search your deck for two Scyther and play them onto the bench. Uh, that could be useful. Agility 20 damage with a coin. If heads prevent all attacks, effects of attacks, including damage. Hmm. Not too sure about that. But as they are saying, it is actually a reprint from the EX on Sync Forces. So we are going to be seeing a lot of reprints in the set that have a little bit things, very, very few things that are altered about them. But like I said, I am going to go straight through guys until I do hit a GX or something pretty nice. And then we'll go ahead and stop and take a quick look at it. We do have an ability right here. So smooth over once during your turn, you may attach, you may search your deck for a card, shuffle the deck, place that card onto the top of your deck. Uh, if you could put it in your hand, it would be a lot better, but <clears throat> I guess that's okay. I guess we can go ahead and take that for right now. Moving on, we do see a Blaziken also has a ability we'll go ahead and check that out you may attach a fire energy card from your discard pile to one of your rear bench pokemon not too bad although it is a stage two so you do have to build him up hmm i don't know about that ability moving on articuno gx this is going to be the first gx that we see right here guys articuno gx does have that legendary ascent once during your turn you may play this Pokemon from your hand onto your bench. You may switch your active Pokemon with this Pokemon. Um, it's gonna see play. I think it's gonna see play. I'm not 100% sure about it. We'll see what happens. That's not till August. We're not gonna see any of these cards until August, so I don't wanna spend too much time on them because I will be talking about them again in a future video but i do just want to take a quick look at how they look we do have another bit ability right there swing dance once during your turn you may draw a card that's first stage two i don't know i don't know i like trade better so we'll see what happens with that we have an electrode gx which i have not seen before so we'll go ahead and zoom in on that bad boy as well ability extra energy bomber once during your turn you may discard this pokemon and all cards attached to it this counts as knocking out this pokemon if you do search your discard pile for five energy cards and attach them 
to your Pokemon in any way you like. Okay, so you sacrifice yourself, get five energy on anybody you like from your discard. But your opponent grabs two prizes. This could come in clutch at the end of the game, possibly. But you still get knocked out, which means... Well, your turn doesn't end. It doesn't say your turn ends, so you could actually use it as a last-minute way to get energy on your bench and then possibly win. Not 100% sure, but I do see some capabilities. We'll see what happens, guys. And then we also do have a Mr. Mime GX. Very nice right there. Has the ability Magic Evens. If your, I mean, if this Pokemon would be damaged by an attack, prevent that attack's damage done to this Pokemon. If the damage is 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 200, 220, 240, 260. Wow. That's pretty cool. Not going to read off the attacks just yet, guys. Like I said, I will have be having future videos on these. Don't want to spend too much time. think the video is already going into 7 minutes. We do have very nice Bayonet GX with Shady Move once during your turn. If this Pokemon is your active Pokemon, you may move one damage counter from either player's Pokemon to another Pokemon. Um, One damage counter, it's a stage 1. Yeah, it could be used. Could be used. We do have an Onyx. Very nice. I do miss Onyx. We have been seeing a lot of Steelix. So we haven't seen Onyx in a while. It would be very nice to see Onyx GX. That would be pretty epic. I remember we saw the Steelix EX, I believe. It was in. Hmm, I can't remember 100% sure what set the Steelix GX. Was in guys Steam Siege? No, it wasn't Steam Siege. Was it Fates Collide? Now, I'm not 100% sure. If you know, leave it in the comments. And we see the Steelix, which evolves from the Onyx, guys. Very nice right there. I have not seen a regular Steelix Hollow in quite some time. We do have our Scissor GX. Very nice with that ability. Danger. Danger Perception. I was about to say Prescription, which would have been pretty weird. As long as this Pokemon's remaining HP is 100 or less, this Pokemon attacks do 80 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon. That's actually very nice. I like that. And I like the art too as well, so that's pretty cool, guys. We're gonna have to check that out a little bit more. We do have a Salamence GX as well. We're gonna be speeding things up a little bit. The video is taking about 10 minutes. Uh, that's where I wanted to end about. So Dragon Lift, the retreat cost of each of the, your Pokemon, excluding EX or GX, is zero. That's good, but for stage two, you still have to evolve up into the Salamence. I don't know, guys. I don't know. A lot of things have to do with evolution. With the new GX, you have to evolve. It's not like having a GX where you just have one powerful guy you can just throw out there right away as a basic and start hitting. I mean, technically you could because we still have Buzzwoe. We still have our typical basic GXs that are really heavy hitters and do need to be worried about. But that's just going to be the quick scheme that I'm going to be going through for this all champion road set. This is the complete set, guys. If you guys do want to check it out, I will be leaving the link down below in the description. But once again, this set won't be coming out till August. So right now, let's worry about Forbidden Light. I will be going to that pre-release and having some code giveaways tonight for you guys. So make sure that you guys do stay tuned for that video. I hope you guys did enjoy this quick news and information. I know it's been a while. I've been off and on work and stuff, sick and stuff. You guys know how it is. It's life. I really appreciate everybody watching. Like always, you guys are awesome. And like everybody knows, it's JP Positive. And I'm out.